I'm Josh Tauber, um, and I want to propose one small way that member offices can take the lead a little bit in government transparency uh, and open government. So a little bit about me. For the last eight years, I've been running govtrack.us, which is a uh, legislative tracking tool, a little bit like congress.gov, and I also was the CTO of Popbox, and I've written a lot about transparency. So this culture change that we have uh, has been led largely by the White House with sites like data.gov and a lot of policy statements. Um, and there hasn't been quite the same leadership in the House, even though there's been a lot of new things like docs.house.gov and all that. So uh, this proposal is, is sort of a way for maybe member personal offices to reclaim some of that leadership. So transparency is already part of member offices. It's just spread across the many roles in each office. So LCs communicate with the public. LAs do research on government reform bills. Um, and so on. So imagine a new office position. So you have LDs and LAs and LCs. What would be the responsibilities of a TD, a transparency director? Okay, I know MRAs aren't what they used to be. This is not maybe a, a practical full-time position, right? But it's, a, it's an idea, so bear with me on that. A TD would share or take on some of the existing responsibilities in the office. He or she might coordinate with the LAs on open government bills or with LCs and sysadmins on helping the office process constituent mail faster. The TD would bring a certain type of expertise. So just like press secretaries are now expected to have social media experience, a TD would be expected to have experience in open government policy or government data mashups. The TD, uh, so let me be more concrete, drawing on some examples of what member offices are already doing. A TD could coordinate a new project on helping uh, your office put vote positions online, like Representative Amash does. He puts an explanation of all of his votes on his Facebook page. Uh, the TD could also identify transparency-related bills that um, have already been introduced that your boss might want to co-sponsor. So there are bills like this on both sides of the aisle, ICE's Data Act, Quigley's Access to Congressionally Mandated Reports Act, uh, and so on. Um, just as an LA might bring subject matter experience like tax policy to the job, the TD would bring experience dealing with these sorts of issues uh, to help your office understand what these bills are about and to, to work on them. Um, a TD might spearhead putting your boss's daily schedule online like Senator Gillibrand does, or the TD might collect your boss's official correspondence with federal agencies and post all of those on your website in some um, useful way. Um, so those sorts of projects would help build trust with the government, with, uh, build trust between your constituents and, and your office. Uh, a TD would also be familiar with some radical technology that some offices have been using, like the Madison Project, which uh, helps the public comment on draft legislation, which came out of ICE's office. So there are a lot of uh, uh, projects that a TD could do, and there are potential TDs out there waiting to be hired. There are consultants in this room, um, and that would bring the right sort of experience. The um, Anyway, that's fine. So uh, a TD uh, might not be practical right now, but I thought it was an interesting idea, so I hope it, it spurs some uh, debate. So thanks.